been a long time coming, more than 50 years since the last crossing, but finally the trains left their respective platforms. And for many Koreans, a long-held hope that the process of reconciliation may have started between their people. We keep doing our best to operate this train of unification which the North and South drive together for our people, peace and unity. They sent two trains across their heavily armed border. Each one carried 100 South Koreans and 50 North Koreans, including celebrities, politicians and even a South Korean conductor from one of the last trains to cross before rail links were cut in 1951. One train pulled out of Dorison Station just south of the border and headed for Panmun Station in the north. while the other started in the north and travelled to Jejin Station in South Korea.
The northern train was pristine with portraits of the late Kim Il-sung and his son Kim Jong-il in the cars. The great leader himself had boarded the train in 1968. On arrival, there were welcoming children with flowers.